Oh my goodness, look at that beauty. Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Wee Brush Cable. I have my new little one here. You see this paper clip? And excuse me, I'm wearing jeans. But yes, uh, when I opened her, I had this beautiful blanket on my, on my lap. But today it's just my oversized sweater, jeans, casual day today. Um... Still at home because we need to wait for our test results. And I've been coughing and sneezing earlier, but no big deal. Um, <clears throat> but I have this paper clip because I put her into this beautiful... <laughs> I'm going to be pausing the camera, guys. I just can't get over it. But um, sorry about that. I had to pause. This is one of my favorite jammies. It's a little slightly big on her. And can you believe this? She is wearing a three month. Three month. Oh my goodness, she's so cute. <laughs> um, let's see what size. It's a Carter's three month. Yeah. Barely see that, but it fits her big. I knew she was a big, heavy girl. <laughs> and it's slightly big on her, but I love it. Now, I have this paper clip here because I really wanted to put this cute hat on her. She has beautiful hair, by the way, but I don't know. I just like babies and hats, but it was a little big, and I don't have any barrettes. Or anything so I carefully made sure that her hair wasn't on like with the clip but I clipped it like folded it over and clipped it so that it could fit her because I think it looks great with this outfit it's so cute and it fits her she has beautiful dark brown and it's super messy because it was in a hat. But I love it's mono rooted, which is beautiful. And Lacey also reborned my bluebell, who also has beautiful hair, much like this. I think it's darker though. So, yeah, all I did was fold it and put a paper clip. So it could fit, and then I make sure that the clip doesn't scratch her head. I guess if I really wanted, I could put like a like ribbon around this to make it, but she won't be moving. She'll be okay. I wanted to come here to talk to you guys for a little bit and to do a name reveal of this beautiful girl um so i'll put this i also have sorry you know what um my mind isn't very um <laughs> it's hard to think when you're when you're not feeling good that's what happens <laughs> so anyways i also have a pat pat order that came um francis picked it up for me so yay so happy i got this notice in my mail a delivery notification and I'm like what is that I like uh, my baby's here I got my baby from Erin um the other baby I'm getting is on her way I know she's not here yet um and then his eBay stuff came in the mail already so well he uses my account for eBay some eBay items and something what could it be like I don't like, if I have a delivery notification, that means I signed up for the emails. And I'm thinking, what did I sign up for? So I looked at the sender details, and it said it's from Ontario. And I'm like, well, 
um, Kelly is in Ontario. She's she's the one that reborned many of my dolls, and um, a good friend too. Well, no, she's close. She's in Ontario, but not from like from where this is from. She's from close to it. So I thought, I wonder if it's from her. And then I'm like, no, but then I wouldn't have I wouldn't have inputted a tracking number. So. I was so confused, and then finally it hit me. Oh, it's Pat Pat. So I have a Pat Pat order. But I also want to do a name reveal of this beauty. Now, at first I was thinking she does look Asian, but when I opened her, she is a lot like me. Like, look, like I look. I don't know what you can see, but she is. She's got those red tones. She's She's got, she's fair toned with the red rose tones, which is exactly me. Um, so she's got the dark hair like me, the dark eyebrows like me. I love her. She's like me. So like, like Lacey did. I love her ears. And in the Canadian North, when it's cold a lot of the year, I think she's just perfect and beautiful. So, I love her. But um, Francis and I have been watching a new show. Oh, no, sorry. I have been watching a new show lately. And it's called Raised by Wolves. And it's a new 2020 um, show that came out. It came out on, I've been watching it on CTV uh, app, which is a Canadian app, but I think it's on Netflix. But it's a sci-fi apocalypse type uh, TV show, and it's really, really good. If you're into, like, um, apocalyptic type future movies, it's, it's exactly that. And I really love it. And there's this boy in the show. His name is Campion. And I thought, oh, I love that name. If I ever get a boy doll, I want to name him Campion. But um, I didn't get this. I want her as a girl. So I thought, well, I can't name her Campion. But what's close? So I thought, hey, I'll, I'll call her Camprian. So her name is Camprian. And then I thought, okay, well, what about a middle name? And that's a fan that kicked in. The heat is cold up here. Um, <laughs> anyways, I, I thought of a middle name. I thought, well, okay, Francis, what is your mom's middle name? And he said her name is Antoinette. And I'm like, oh, I like that. She looks like an Antoinette as well. So this is Camprian Antoinette. And I love her love her so much oh and she still smells beautiful but I wanted to put her into some jammies and I just I love her I love her weight I love the way she looks she's she's beautiful so hey Camprian Camprian Cammy so yeah so let's get on to the Pat Pat order. Move her ever so gently. Look at her. Like, look at this. She's like a real baby. She's sleeping. Okay. Move her. Oh, um, before I get to Pat Pat, I just I wanted to say um, some of you are on my Instagram. Oh, yeah, I did mention it in a video yesterday. I got tested for COVID along with my son. And um, I just want to let you know that um, I don't know. This is off topic. <laughs> but I don't know. Some of you may know that I'm into like surviving disaster and being prepared, being emergency preparedness is one of my passions. And yesterday, um, not yesterday, it was a couple of days ago, we ran out of toilet paper. And because of the COVID, and I do listen to the rules, and I'm self-isolating, I'm not going out shopping, 
Um, I actually, all I had to do was go downstairs into my basement and I have a stash of toilet paper, paper towel, I have Kleenex, we have plenty of food, we have lots of medication on hand like Tylenol, Advil, whatever. Um, but I think I, I think I mentioned that in the 20 things about me. Anyways, anyways, point is, is that even though we are self-isolating at home, don't worry about our well-being of like food or products or whatever because I believe in being prepared and I went into my stash and got some. So <laughs> anyways, let's get on the Pat Pat. Oh, I can't wait. I really loved Pat Pat. The first time I ordered from there, I loved everything. Everything. So they had, oops, I accidentally cut into this bag. Thank goodness, not the product. But I was, I was so excited to have the opportunity again. Oops. I was, okay, maybe. Okay, here's some ASMR. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, the one that cut up is actually one of my favorites that I want to wait until the end. Oh. And I did, um, I did watch Julie's Pat Pat haul, and she got something like for twins and I'm thinking well I have twins now I have a girl and a boy twin so that's a good idea why not get like two of something and maybe for a boy and girl I thought like you know just different colors with that said I'm not showing you or wait I'll just show you I'm not I didn't go through oh wait I did order two of those Okay, I think I ordered three because, oh wait, how many did I get? <laughs> I was thinking of, of gifting. <laughs> okay, how many are here? Are they all, oh, they're not the same. Okay, this one's different. Okay, um, I ordered some to make a twin set, but I also got two different sizes. So I think that's why there are four of them. So I was, I do have twin girls, by the way, as well. I have uh, two Greta's. So the Greta sculpt. So I got this beautiful, and I was thinking too that I would love to maybe gift like the one that is either too big or too small, or I don't know. I was thinking of Julie when I saw this. It's a long sleeve. Ooh, and it looks big. Some of the things I found super big and some things I found that were all right. This is supposed to be a zero to three. And yeah, it's a big zero to three. I would say like three month. But I love that this would fit the Greta's quite nicely and I love it isn't it beautiful I love it so I actually I bought two of the zero to three and I think there's two of the newborn because I also have newborn twins girls like smaller twins yes this is a newborn so two newborns and two of the zero to three. I thought that I would share a zero to three with Julie. Um, if, if you're watching Julie, cover your ears. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, I'm not sure when I could sell, send mail again. There's huge case thing uproar going on. But isn't this set beautiful? So, yeah, I can't remember what all I ordered. <laughs> it's been a month, you guys. This papa takes a long time to get to you. 
In fact, I even forgot I ordered from Pat Pat. Like, I was trying to think, like, why do I have a package? And why is it tracked? Like, why would, why would I track? Well, it was a Pat Pat order. Apparently, it started October 13th. So, but I'm not sure when I ordered it, like, before them. But that was when it was finally shipped. So, that is one set. And sorry, I'm rambling. Ramble, ramble. This is, this is beautiful. Um, this is, like, oh, this one feels different. <gasps> oh, it's so nice. Look at that. I think... Julie has something similar, and I just love it. That is gorgeous, and it feels so soft. See these? This one feels... The fabric is different. This says newborn. But if you notice, like, these tags are different. Like, this will just have probably a number. 100. Ooh, and it's stretchy. Oh, wow. Stretchy material. This one is just, like, soft. Wow, this feels... Sorry. Okay, good. It looks like I didn't miss anything. That's good, but this is beautiful. I was thinking my Saskia or my Gertie would look beautiful in this outfit especially for fall and spring like when it's still cool out but um i should put this so i don't lose because there are also items on the bank but that one is so pretty i love it okay um these are this is a headband i think I don't know. Let's find out. Ooh. Oh, yes. I was thinking of my toddlers. These are so pretty. Like on Xena or LOD. LOD would look really pretty. I bought a whole bunch of these, like different colors. But I thought this would look so pretty in the back of their hair. Like, they're huge, huge barrette clips. These bows would look, like, really big in the back of their hair, but yet so pretty. So I got, I know I got a few different colors. There's that gray. This is a dark green. Like a Christmas, I was thinking Christmas green. And this gray would go with anything. And I'm pretty sure I got another one. Like a few of these colors. But I thought that big bow would look perfect. Because I have tons of bows already. But nothing huge like that. Um, what are these? What is that? Um, I think, I think this might be a bow. A black bow. Yeah, a black and a black one, which will also go with everything. And I can't remember if I ordered like, I got like five of them. Yeah, and then there's this rose, dark rose pink one which is so pretty i thought they would look so nice in their hair even carly's hair like my big girls i have with hair with gorgeous hair is carly rebecca xena elodie like for sure and the four girls okay i think that's it these other ones are different these are like some socks yeah because i don't have anything like really pretty like see i love these how pretty they are yeah 
And I got two different colors of these. Look at this one. But I really wanted like the older girls to have beautiful, like I have baby socks of these, but I don't have like toddler or bigger girls of these. And especially Elodie, she would look so pretty in a dress and these. So pretty. So I got like a pink one. And I I don't know if this is I think these are the socks too. Yeah, these are gray. So gray socks. Oh these just have the bow on them. They don't have the the pearl. And these ones are like this. But the older girls would look so pretty. Like in a dress with these. Oh, it looks like I have to trim up this extra lace. But it's so pretty. And so those are the socks. The pretty of these socks. I have lots of little baby newborn of these type. I don't have any toddler and bigger child ones, so. Now these ones are going to be a favorite. I always wanted tights. These look so boho. I love it. I absolutely adore that. Oh, it's like ultimately brand new. Wow, look at those. They're gorgeous. They're stock tights. And aren't they so pretty? Finally, I have some sock type tights. And these, I love the color. They're like a dark beige or a light milk chocolate. Oh, I love them. They look so pretty and boho. I love it. I absolutely love it. Nature and boho is one of my favorite looks of all time. Kind of ties in with that old Victorian. And then I bought these boho. Or, I shouldn't call them boho. <laughs> boho tights. No. I don't know what they call them. But, tights? I don't know. And then I got this cocky. It says cocky, but let's see what. Oh. I like a dark ivory. Pretty. Oh, I love them. They look so pretty on somebody. I love that. Oh, I'm so happy, Kate. I'm leaving those out. No, I'm putting that back. And then <laughs> these are some shoes that would really go with my Inuit girl. I have an outfit that would fit these perfectly. They look like this. Oh, there's, oh, they're, oops. They're like, this is like a suede or a leather feel. Oh, I love it. So, I just wanna see what you would take out. Let's see how they would feel. Oh yeah, they there's an elastic here, so you can put them on. Oh, they're so pretty. I love them. This is the smallest size one. They didn't have a zero, but yay, I love them. And I have those that would definitely fit. Now the two of my favorite, the star of Pat Pat. 
and the one that I accidentally ripped into. So I got a twin set of this and this. This is one I accidentally cut into. Oh, this is beautiful. It's like a like the baby muslin feel. Isn't that gorgeous? It's a if you can see that. Oh, these these will fit the twins so perfectly. And this is my also like the boho theme plus outdoors. That is me definitely. So I live in the woods. I'm an outdoor enthusiast and survivalist. I love bushcraft and uh, off the grid cabin life, homesteading. I really enjoy that kind of stuff. So I love this. So I got this is like a light peachy color. I thought that would be awesome on my girl. And this one is the exact same thing the exact same size but a white one and i thought this one would look awesome on my boy so i can't wait to dress him up one day in these things yeah i'm so happy so yes they came so here's campion let's see fix her hat oh. She's so sweet. And anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Hope that you're doing well and hoping to hear my results. I don't know. If not today, then tomorrow. Nothing so far. I keep checking. Like It says come back in 24 hours to check. And I check it like every 20 minutes. So, <laughs> but anyways, guys, hope that you're having a great day. And love you. Take care. Much hand, guys. Match it. Love you guys. Thank you so much for all your support and for you guys being here. Couldn't be here without you. Bye guys.